life passed to death death do you, why do people love me but hate you death responded because you are a beautiful lie and i am a painful truth today our dear sister pedo teaches us to reflect on the mystery of life and death life is short so make it sweet and worthwhile be happy and be passionate only love and goodness are enough to stand upright in the presence of god i think this is what sister tedo has said to all of us on her glorious entry into heaven in her 75 years of life for nearly 20 years she was a sweet daughter called elizabeth and to many particularly in ennor she is sweetly called as sister elsie and for long 55 years for all of us the sisters of jmj she was our beloved sister pedrosia which means god's gift indeed sister pedro was a wonderful gift of god to our congregation to all the people who she served and to each and every one of us here spread love everywhere you go was the dictum of her life on her final journey we are around sister pedro paying our tributes to this great soul whose love and affection we all have experienced in different ways she has spread god's love to everyone she met by her very exemplary simple down to earth life of poverty she never longed for a name or a position she possessed minimum things just a couple of clothes she was loved much because she loved much our dear sister pedro was a person for certification of simplicity sacrifice self discipline and hard work a passionate lover of children a simple soul who taught little children with loving care and tenderness she was an exemplary evangelizer a great pastoral worker a gifted formator and a passionate humanitarian dear sister tedo when we met you on the 12th november we did not think that would be our last encounter with you and so you would be gone to your eternal home we owe our deep gratitude to your sister for setting before us a great challenge to live our consecrated life with all sincerity and loyalty you have proved in your life that to live is to die to die for many attachments and desires and by dying to this material world you live as a free child of god so cheerfully so contently giving yourself unconditionally serving god and his people in many ways
Your words have not only inspired us, but also painted a living picture of the life of dedication and faith, reminding us of all the wonderful that she had on those around her. We are ever grateful to the parish council, parishioners, and lay associates from the Sagamata Church, you know, for their unbearable support and kindness for us in the leadership and charity community.
God come to her and come to meet the angels of the Lord. Receive her soul and present her to God the Most High. May Christ, who called you, take you to Himself. May angels lead you to Abraham's side. Receive her soul and present her to God the Most High. Give her eternal rest, O Lord, and may your light shine upon her forever. Receive her soul and present her to God the Most High. Our Father, who art in heaven, Lead us not in temptation, but deliver us from evil. Into your hands we commend our sister and see. We are confident that with all who have died in Christ, she will be raised to life on the last day and will live with Christ forever. We thank you for all the blessing you gave her in this life to show your fatherly care for all of us and the fellowship which is ours with the saints in Jesus Christ. The Lord, hear our prayer. We welcome our brother sister to paradise and help us to comfort each other with the assurance of our faith. To be with you and to be with our sister forever, we make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. To lead you into paradise, may the martyrs come to welcome you and take you to the holy city, the new and eternal Jerusalem.